together all the time. It's he's a family guy. Now he's he's decided to serve uh, the community. Do you think and do you feel uh, like he's going to be outside the family? Uh, outside the family, I no because Bahati is a family person and he really knows how to balance so many things even when it comes to his music his brand uh, his job and everything that he does he is the perfect definition of somebody who knows how to balance everything so I am not thinking otherwise about him changing to be not so much of a family man yeah and are you ready to campaign uh, with him uh, you know once you marry your best friend his life becomes your life. So Akunaya, I'm not ready for this one, I'm ready for this one. Everything he touches flows with it. Everything you touch, he flows with it. Yeah, so I am ready to hold his hand all the way. Yeah. So uh, uh, Diana, just tell us uh, uh, briefly, why are we here at Comorock today? Uh, today, actually this day is made for to celebrate uh, the babies who actually were born at Comorock Water Healthcare. Uh, so it's actually dubbed uh, babies and the people have come out in numbers. I am sure not everyone was born here, but the fact that uh, the doors are open at Komarok Modern Health, it's amazing. And just to see all these kids coming here to have a good time with their, with their parents, it's overwhelming. So uh, Dr. Nyamu is organizing so so many things and uh, he's uh, very philanthropic, he's giving back to the society. Just tell us about him. What is your relationship with him? Brand ambassador to Comarok Modern Healthcare. Uh, of course, he's my boss. Uh, that's the relationship that we have. And uh, him being philanthropic, I, I salute him because Comarok Modern Healthcare is is not an ordinary healthcare, you know. Uh, and I'm sure we've done so many events that you guys have witnessed and have been here to see. And uh, his heart is out there just to make sure that everybody is served well. Yes. <laughs> to bring that here. Yes. Okay. To make a statement. Yes, you have to. <laughs> Diana B, mm. obviously your babies have been born here. How does it feel that the babies that were born in this uh, hospital are now healthy, kicking and running around with other kids? Uh, just a correction, my babies were not born here. Uh, my babies were born elsewhere. I just recently joined uh, Comarok Modern as their brand ambassadors, but my uh, two nephews have been born here from my sisters and uh, just to see them grow, just to see them healthy, they come here for their clinics and all that, it's, it's, it's good, you know, it's a hospital where, you know, you, you trust their services. Diana, once again, congratulations for being a common brand ambassador. How do you feel to be a brand ambassador? To be a brand ambassador? I feel amazing to represent the best. That's it. I represent the best and it's amazing. Thank you. <laughs> now, uh, yesterday, TTNT3 happened and uh, we had a surprise uh, announcement. Jigush and Celestine are expecting a second baby. Now, you being a close friend to them, being in the industry, what is that one word you can advise, um, a word you can share with them? I wasn't there personally, but of course I heard about the news and I want to say a big congratulations to the two of them. It's 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 something huge. You know, you are having another bundle into you family. Uh, words cannot express that enough. And um, I know they are happy. Nojua, they've been with uh, like a small boy for like now three, four years actually. Because I think a month or two. I think a month or two. month or two. So I can imagine the joy in their hearts and I am so, so, so happy for them. Congratulations Celestine and Jukush. I know Sisi uh, Binadamu Kosa, what is that one thing you can never forget? Because uh, most, most of Kenyans are going to have a position of Kosa, are going to have a Kamarino Pali. You know, so where was Samir? You know, if you'd ask me that Kitambo, I'd give you so many things. But right now, I think when you progress with life, you come to realize there are things that you don't take to heart. And you also realize that even people are at that particular point realize that they made mistakes even me myself being in i realize at that point i made mistakes you know so as you grow you wouldn't sit down and say i'll never forgive this because even you when you sit down you know so i think time heals everything yeah so 
So uh, Diana, you've become very influential. You have a cult following. Uh, let me ask you, how do you handle that? And there's uh, just the other day, there's some lady who tattooed her, your face on her back, and you met her. Tell us about the experience. Uh, you've asked me two questions. Uh, let me talk about the tattoo lady first. When I first of all heard about, uh, she's called uh, Waidera. <laughs> so when I heard about uh, her putting her tattoo on my t a tattoo of me on her back, I was shocked. Nili kwa I think na shiva nili kwa ni shake. I was like, what do you mean? That's a lie. It can't happen. And uh, I think I took a lot of time. I waited for it to uh, absorb in my system. And then later on, I met her, and uh, it was it was it was nice. I bonded with her, and I think the whole experience. Quite humbling that you know, you are a stranger, somebody who you don't know, can actually go out of their way and do something like that. Whereas I'm sure she has a mom, she has a father, she has siblings. That was truly humbling. So uh, let me ask you, what do you think that you're doing that really inspires people out there? I just, I'm just me, you know. I'm just me, and you cannot face, you cannot. That's uh, magic. What's the word? You cannot. No, I have to. I have to say that word. <laughs> uh, how is it? Danganya kini mekosa word. But how is it? Danganya kumwe we. Unajua. It shows over time. You know that this is who this person truly is. So I think me just being me, and the fact that I think I have. Anytime I feel like I'm to and I go through something, Nini, and I feel like I can do something to help that person, I do it open heartedly. Yeah. So in your house, yeah. uh, you guys are really having fun from your husband mm. to your the kids mm -hmm. that you're raising mm -hmm. to your nannies. And the other day, the, your nannies actually surprised you, and you said that you will never accept them uh, to, to get another surprise from them. Surprise or prank? A, a prank from okay. them, sorry. sorry. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Okay, how do you plan not to, do, to be surprised or to be pranked again by them? Isi vitu wakuna vile uneza panga, but unajua na semanga yao ni international la panga. Hakuna kutuna panga actually, nini tu itakuja ikuja, but they got me a good one and I appreciate them. We are going out of their way just to make sure that we create content for you guys out here. It's nice. And you guys, you are supposed to open a channel for them. What is the progress? Uh, we've not yet uh, done much about it. There's so much going on. There's so much going on in the family. So it's not like we have to make a Oh, by the way, we just get overwhelmed with things. Kufungwa channel seki tu kubwa. Unajua ni actually tu kupati amtu direction. Fungulia Iron Channel. Ama fungulia my nanny's channel. And then start running with it. Yeah. So it's not like we've, we've not like been serious about it. started groundbreaking, we have seen the Moriahs are groundbreaking for their dream home. How is it feel, how, how does it feel to own and perform as an artist and as well to just grow and, and, and add pace and content uh, First of all, I feel amazing to have my own home, uh, thanks to my husband. And I'm a witness, or rather we are a witness of hard work pace. You know, nothing comes easy. And as long as you put your heart and your They're like, mommy, do this, mommy, do that. I wake up because of them. And let me tell you, don't ever sit down and think, Vilambasema, art does not pay. Art pays. That is what I do. I do content creation. And content creation is what has opened doors for me for clients to come and trust me to work for their brands, you know? So you just need a little push in your life. And doors will open. It's just a matter of time. So be happy for other people. Don't be envious. Don't be jealous. Wait for your time. Yeah. Uh, let me just one last question. Uh, 
just uh, some time back in the past, we saw some uh, some news online about uh, probably you and Mr. Seed's wife having some differences. Uh, has there been such differences, and uh, uh, have you tried to sort it out? What is the situation? My mayor, I think you've seen Mr. Seed's uh, wife here. Nemo is here, and uh, like I mentioned earlier, you know people make mistakes. Uh, you come to realize uh, Pegina was not mature enough to handle this in a better way, you know, and you grow out of it. And sometimes you don't need to come and apologize. Life teaches us lessons differently, you know, and you're like, sometimes we're like, ah, you in a to do your time. Unajua wacha to come say, wacha to come poor. But it's just that we have never met. Ever since that incident, we have never met. Actually, this is the first time that I have seen her, and I'm happy to see her together. that aside, forgive her, or forgive each other, and just say hi to each other. I with her. As a matter of fact, there was a time something was going on in my life, and she called me, and I picked the phone, and we said hi, and we talked, and we, I, I think I was on a flight, and I told her we're going to talk later. I have no problem with her, so it's not like, I take, can you sit down, can you forgive, can you need me? There's no issue. We are, we are okay. Yeah.